Hey guys, Dynasty Warrior 6 here again with another Game Finds video. Um, I do apologize about how long it's been. I've been meaning to do another one. It's just been, I've been super busy with everything going on in life. So now that I've got a brief moment to take a breather, organize my stuff, and just kind of get things, you know, organized, just really organized, because I've been so busy. Like, I, get, I buy games and I still collect and everything like that. It's just, I can't... Yeah, I get so sidetracked with everything else in my life, you know, like now I got, I have a yard I have to actually maintain now sometimes, so I've got to do that a lot of the time now, so I've been real busy, I do apologize about that guys, but uh, I do have a good chunk of game finds, I've gotten some really good stuff, so we'll kind of just jump right into it like we always do, and we'll just work our way from, these are all going to be separated into kind of bundles. Like, the first couple of games I'm going to show you are games I just kind of bought individually from stores and stuff that I was kind of like, oh, okay, that's a good deal. So we'll just kind of do the individual ones first, and then we'll do the bundles, all right? So first one that was just one of the games I bought randomly, I bought a Kessen. Do, 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 Kessen. Sorry about the lighting, guys. In fact, here, let's uh, turn the light on, actually, to get that situated. Maybe that will help with the lighting. There we go. Oh, a little better. Kessin. It is complete. Uh, this was $4. Um, pretty good condition. Uh, I was pretty happy to get this game again. I've seen, I've seen a lot of game stores selling this game now for like $10.15, and I can't figure out why. I'm not knocking it. I, I, I love Kessin in the Kessin series, except Kessin 2. But Kessin 1 is really dated. Like, you look at it, and you play it, and you're like, what the hell were they thinking? But... Clearly, uh, it's going up in value. I can't figure it out why. Why? Why? Well, you know, the game stores here are selling it for ten, fifteen. I found it for four dollars at a game store. Thankfully, though, and it's only worth like five bucks top. The game is dated, sadly. It's a lot of fun. It's got really good voice acting, but definitely a dated game. So, but I got it for four bucks. All right, I'll just set that down. Yeah, let that right there. All right, next up. Oh, and uh, next up we got. I got for. Five ten dollars. I got Spyro Two Season or what is it? Uh, Season of Flame. Sorry, Spyro Two Season of Flame. Oh, I got to get that sticker off. Oh, that's not it. That was not it. Uh, that was not it. That was a good deal actually. Sorry about that. Uh, <laughs> that they gave me a discount. But uh, Spyro Two uh, Season of Flame. Uh, I got it for five ten dollars. I can't remember exactly, but. Um, I only bought it just because it was there. It was it was one of like the only things I really saw, and I was kind of like, oh, okay, I'll get another. I don't have any Spyro games even on PS One anymore. I'm trying to find them, and I'm having a hard time finding them right now. So, go figure on that one. Next up that I got for fifteen dollars, I picked up Perfect Dark. Now it does have this little like lit, like sticker on the back or tape on the back, but I'll try to get that off eventually. But Perfect Dark for fifteen dollars, not too bad. Not 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 too not too bad of a game to get for 15 bucks i gotta get that off but um i got it uh at a game store and it was just i'm trying to rebuild each video game collection slowly but not like trying to overwhelm myself by buying tons of games for different consoles and stuff like that right now i'm focusing mostly on n64 super nintendo and ps1 a little bit on ps2 i'm not gonna say i'm not doing ps2 but the ps2 deals have to be there they have to be deals and they have to be games on like like jrpgs and dynasty warriors and romance of the three kingdoms if they're not if they're not there they're not there so there we go on that one and the last one i picked up for twenty dollars not bad it was black label crash bandicoot warped three warped whatever you want to call it for uh ps1 black label uh, i was very happy to get this game again i love crash bandicoot 3 i've always been torn about which one's my favorite between these two is it crash bandicoot 2 or crash bandicoot 3 i really like three better than two but like in spyro on ps1 i like uh ripto's rage which is technically two versus year of the dragon which is like year uh three so you know, there you go. But yep, got Super Crash Bandicoot three warped for twenty bucks. And then we'll go with the one, another video game store deal that I got. I picked up. They were doing this buy one get two free deal at uh, this retro game trader on all their PS2 titles. Not bad. So I picked up. I paid six dollars for this one. I got Kessen three. Now Kessen three is really good game. If you never played it, you gotta try it. A lot of great voice actors are in this game. 
A lot of them would do anime. Crispin Freeman's the main lead. He plays Nobunaga, and oh man, he does a good job. So, yep, this is this was six dollars though. And the next two games were totally free because it was buy two get free. So, uh, I picked up just because you're supposed to. You should have this game in your collection, and it's on PS2 and Grand Theft Auto Vice City. It was free, complete. And I picked up this one. I didn't see anything else there I really wanted that was free, so I picked this up for free. Dark Angel. Vampire Apocalypse. Um, never heard of it. Never even saw it. I thought, eh, you know, it's it was free. It, it, I'm not going to complain about a free, you know, getting a free game. Not really, you know. Come on. So that was it for those. Next up, we'll do the now. This I'll show you. Um, this one bundle was a hundred and fifty dollars. Uh, I'm just going to tell you guys that straight out. That way, there's no like, oh, you know. And it, all these games were included for $150. And they're all Super Nintendo. Super Ghouls and Ghosts. Is that it? Yeah, Super Ghouls and Ghosts. And sadly, it's got a little Sharpie writing on the back. Zombies Ate My Neighbors. Another Sharpie right there. But all these games have pretty good label condition, except this one right here, Shadowrun. Need to clean it still. <laughs> Super Mario All-Stars plus Super Mario World, good condition. Super Castlevania 4, must have. This is a fun game. I can never get past the water level though. I like I always get stuck at one point. I, like even though I love this game and I love playing it, I can never get past that one point. I suck. And Final Fantasy 3, good condition. And the last one is Mortal Kombat 3 complete in box. Yep. Very nice. A good condition. Good condition box. Very clean. Very clean. Very crisp. Very nice. Uh, next up, this is the pretty much last bundle. Um, there isn't anything else left. And this one was $200 even. Um, we came, you know, we, we agreed on the price and we came to $200 and we were okay with it. Now, a lot of these games are not complete in box. Like, there is some that are, but I will let you guys know. I'm not going to pull them out and show, but I know which ones aren't and which ones are. But that was the agreement. I wanted some boxes and manuals, and I got some. And some really good ones, too. It was a Super Nintendo N64, and there was the, all these are box and manual, and some are complete. So, we'll jump right into it. The first one was The Lion King, box and manual only. No game. No game. Damn, box. Yeah, I, but I, you can get the Lion King game for, gosh damn, you know, five bucks or something like that. Then I can complete this. But this one is only box and manual, sadly. Next up, uh, box. It, this one is complete in box. It is Toy Story. Pretty good condition. You know, of course, you have some corner, but, you know, that's normal. Uh, the next one, really good. Uh, really good. Illusion of Gaia, complete in box. Got to love Illusion of Gaia. And the last one of the Super Nintendo variety is Contra 3, The Alien Wars, complete in box. This was definitely the reason, like the big reason why I wanted this deal in is Contra 3, The Alien Wars. I, you know, gosh damn. So, got Contra 3, The Alien Wars. All right, next up. Um, these are all just boxes and manuals, every single one of these. None of these are complete. These are missing their games. So, just boxes and manuals, guys, just in case. So, first one. Pokemon Stadium, big fat boy. Yeah, nothing nothing in there except the manual. Next up, Donkey Kong 64. Collector's Edition, yellow game puck. Yeah, Don Donkey Kong 64. Mario Party 2. These are all just boxes and manuals, of course. Just And the last one, and this is like, if you get the game and you have the box and the manual for this guy, this is definitely going to be a really nice game to have complete in box eventually when I get it. Super Smash Brothers. Yeah, I was real happy getting this box and manual because this is definitely the one you want to have, you know, because Super Smash Brothers, man, oh gosh. You know, it's a great game on N64. I just need to get the box, or I just need to get the game now, and then I'll have it complete in box. So. Got a lot of box and manuals from those, but I'm not done yet. I got two more N64 games that are complete in box. Uh, one box is kind of eh on the condition, but it's okay. It's not, it's, it, you know, it's 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 all right. It is uh, Pokemon Snap? There we go, Pokemon Snap. But yeah, box is kind of crunched a little bit. It's going you know, but it's okay. It happens. And the last one was it was one of my favorite N64 games of all time. 
GoldenEye 007, complete in box. So, very happy to add this guy into my collection again and having a complete in box. Last time I only had it loose cart, this time I got a complete in box. Very good to have. So, that is it, guys. That is currently the status quo of my collection. You know, it's, it is rebuilding very slowly. Um, you know, it is taking time. Um, I'm not like able... I'm able to, but I don't, you know, you got, I got to rebuild my savings account. I'm working on getting the house fixed up at certain points on certain things. And it's just kind of like, okay, I got to fix this or, or, you know, and then I'm paying bills and, you know, I'm really, I'm getting, I'm getting ahead though. I am getting ahead. It's, it's, it's good because I've, I've got roommates and everything like that. And I'm able to, you know, save money and pay bills earlier and take care of things. And, you know, it's a lot easier now. So that is about it, and I will talk to you guys later. Thank you. Bye-bye.